Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to mine Ethereum on almost any computer or laptops and of course as many as you have, as better it is because you can put them to mine on the same address. Basically if you have as an example one computer and two laptops, you can set them to mine on the same address and you guessed that right, yes you'll mine faster the Ethereum. What miner I'm using is unminable, I used that in the past and this is why I recommended this one. I used it to mine in the past Dogecoin and when I reached 30 Doge I withdrew them all. Well, don't worry I will explain to you all the process immediately and it's not that complicated it's actually very easy when you are on the unminable website you will have a button right here which is get started and you have to download the mfi version now almost every miner this is a very common problem with them they will be probably recognized as a dangerous file and you can keep them and i'll show exactly step by step how but of course it's better to do your own research i just wanted to recommend you this one because i used that in the past and it worked for me but of course you can choose the miner you feel more comfortable with okay it's almost almost downloaded it was recognized as a dangerous file you can press ctrl and j just in june to hit downloads and from here you can keep the file i'll press on keep dangerous files and keep anyway and i'll press show on folder now i will move this on my desktop and of course i will extract this i will extract this on my desktop because i don't have a uh, on hard disk I have only an SSD and this is the miner, this is the software, I just put this on my desktop also and let's open this. Right now we are almost halfway done, I will press on more info because it was recognized again and run anyway and uh, I will choose only for me next and the location looks very good for me and let's uh, press on finish and it should be run automatically press on continue and from here you can choose your mining software you can choose phoenix miner and miner or lol miner of course you have some specs for all of them i recommend you to choose phoenix miner and you can choose the component you want to mine with you can choose the cpu which is your processor or the graphics card which is your gpu and i'll select my graphics card and phoenix miner and press next and right now you need an address if you don't have an address you can get one from crypto.com is an app for android and iphone also i used that in the past and i'm still using this and recently i made an account on binance you can get an address from binance also or the most important thing make an address where you feel more comfortable with i will show you how to get an address from binance to create an account on binance basically you have to take two pictures from your id one from the front and one from the back and the process should should take only 20 minutes or less at least for me it took only 20 minutes to get approved on Binance now once you have the account you will have the wallet on the top right I will press on that and you can find here fight and spot which is deposit and withdraw I will press on here and right now I'll have to choose the, the coin I want to mine. As I choose uh, Ethereum on, uh, on Unminable, of course I have to choose uh, Ethereum on uh, Binance. I will press on Crypto Deposit, which is right here, Deposit, and I will have to search for Ethereum. I will change the Bitcoin with, uh, with the Ethereum, found it, and of course you have to choose a network which is compatible with, with Binance. After you choose one, you will get your address, and right now you are, I think, 90% done. I will copy this address and I will place it right into Unminable, but let me choose uh, Ethereum, I was on, uh, on Bitcoin. Okay, I choose Ethereum, I place my uh, my address now and this step is just optional guys, uh, you can press on I have a referral code and this is my referral code, if you want to use it it's just optional and you lower your fees up to 0.75% from 1%. Anyway, I will continue, I will press on start and I just started to mine Ethereum right now. The first sign that you started to mine Ethereum, you'll see some local hash rate here. Instead of 0, you should see 10, 12 or 20 and the graph should increase. Now let me show you some settings on Unminable. You will have a gear right here, advanced settings and from here you can choose the intensity you want to mine with. If you choose the low intensity, you will not hear your fans that loud but if they will not bother you, you can choose the high intensity. If it's an ok computer or a good computer you can still use the computer while you're mining i will choose the high intensity and here you can nickname the miner because if you want to mine with more than one computer or more than one laptop on the same address you i recommend you to 
nickname them to see with which one you have a better performance because you can check the stats and also my referral code and if you mark this on basically what will happen when you start up the computer unminable will open up automatically and will start mining ethereum as you set it and I will press on save and restart and I want to see, okay, the graph just appeared but, but as I restarted it, it's, uh, it's again on zero but immediately it should, uh, it should increase. Probably something else you notice here, payouts from 0.05 Ethereum. What that means, you can withdraw the Ethereum you just mine on Unminable to your address. When you reach 0.05 Ethereum, you can transfer them to your address. As I selected Binance, they will be moved on my Binance address. And how can you do that? You have here uh, this little earth, I will press on that. And once I have 0.05 Ethereum, I will be able to press on this blue button which is payout now. Or you can mark this on and once you have 0.05 Ethereum, they will be transferred automatically to your uh, address. And basically, this is how easy it is to mine Ethereum or on almost any computer or laptop. But if you have more than one computer or more than one laptop, I will recommend you to put them mine on the same address because you will mine Ethereum even faster. But now the mining speed, of course, it depends on the computer performance. And this payout amount is different from coin to coin. If you, as I told you, if you want to mine Dogecoin as an example, the amount will be only 30 Doge. Once you have 30 Doge, you can withdraw them all to your address. Or if you want to mine Shiba, Shiba Inu coin, you can withdraw the Shiba once you have 5 millions. I know that it sounds like a big number, but Shiba can be mined very, very quick. I think if I remember right, if I will start mining Shiba right now, in 20 seconds, I should mine already 5 or 3 three shiba so the speed is different from coin to coin from the computer to computer and so on i really hope i help you guys with this and of course if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment to leave a question down below right under this video don't forget to smash the like button and thank you for watching have a nice day